What is up everyone, it is Andrew Pierre here bringing you guys a new YouTube video. In this YouTube video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to use um, a MIDI pack or a score pack. This is like a pack that has pre, uh, pretty much saved MIDI files or scores to help you guys come up with melodies. Um, we are currently finishing up and working on our AT Melody MIDI pack which will be available at b2at.com in the drum kits and download section. Um, so yeah, uh, when this drum MIDI kit isn't 100% done, but I'm trying to show you guys this tutorial, so when it does come out, you'll all know how to use it. So if we're looking in here, we're in the FL Studio uh, um, main folder, kind of where I got the data patches uh, folder where I like to keep all my drum kits and stuff. Uh, most of you guys probably have your stuff in the packs, but I like to keep everything um, that I use on a regular basis out here. Um, so yeah, that is just where you would put the MIDI pack, which if we look in here, we got the MIDI, which these aren't all the files we're adding more. Um, and then we got the scores. So the scores are FL Studio score files, and then the MIDI are the actual MIDI files, which can be used in any DAW. So if we minimize that, we're in FL Studio. So now we could see the ATML MIDI pack. Boom. So I'm going to go insert Nexus. Oh, let's just go through piano. And grand piano. Sure. Let's grab the trap melody 12. So literally, I could do this with the score or MIDI, any one of them. If I drag it, and boom, it already has the notes laid out. So scores, I mean any of these really work. And it does the same thing. So, now if we play it. So what we could do is then go in here and we could even change the notes. Control up, put up one octave. You can go track. This is how you can pretty much turn this into your own little sound. make a little beat for y'all with this. I mean, this is so easy. This is how you guys can be making your beat super easy. And this drum kit is going to be coming out super soon. Let's put this right there. Put this right there. Put this right there. Put this right there. And I mean, that's how you pretty much use a MIDI kit. I mean, we already got uh, the skeleton of a beat laid down. Then we could insert another sound. Oh, I don't know. 
I mean, we're pretty much done. You guys should know how to use a MIDI kit now, but... So yeah, that's all you really need to know how to use a MIDI kit. So yeah, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up, share, comment, and subscribe. We do a lot of how-to videos and upload beat videos and much more. So subscribing is kind of like a win-win. It's a win for us, win for you. So yeah, this is Andrew Peer here, and I'll see you guys later.